Yo, hey, what's up guys? Coachy here on another episode, episode five of the Tandem Talk Show. I'm your host, Coach G, and as you know, each Tuesday at 7.30, I go live to answer your most important questions about fat loss and to discuss one topic to make fat loss easier, help you gain muscle faster, and to make this whole dieting process a lot more simple. As I mentioned, my name is Coach G, and I'm not wearing these funny looking glasses to make me look cool. These are actually my blue wave blocking glasses. In today's episode, I'm gonna to talk to you about my both my EV routines and my morning routines that help me stay focused, enhance my productivity, to help me achieve optimal performance throughout the day, and to also help me stay on track to achieve my body composition and nutrition goals. So guys, these glasses, um, and again, they are called blue wave blocking glasses. They do exactly what they say. They block blue waves. So what are blue waves? Blue waves are waves. You can't see them. At least I can't. And if you see like a ring here, that's the effect of having a ring light at nighttime. I had this light because it helps me see during videos. I have a very dark house. Anyway, so they block waves from electronic devices like this cell phone here, um, a laptop, television, that would interfere with your production of melatonin. So melatonin is a hormone that is produced in your pineal gland, in your hypothalamus, that helps to regulate sleep and wake cycles. So basically when it's dark and there's no lights around, melatonin is produced and it tells your body to go to sleep. Now when there's light around like the morning and daytime, light penetrates through the eye, and it tells the body, hey, it's daytime, stay up. So it decreases the production of melatonin, cause you not to feel tired. So guys, why is this important? Because if you stare at your phone at nighttime, it's essentially blocking your ability to regulate that sleep hormone to get optimal sleep. Sleep is so important for fat loss. Guys, I have written extensively about the benefits of sleep on fat loss. Let me give you a few reasons why you need at least seven to nine hours of sleep a night. First off, number one, there has been substantial evidence that shows that people who get five or fewer hours of sleep a night going throughout a fat loss phase, they lose considerably more muscle mass and they gain body fat just from having this circadian disrupt from not getting a lot of sleep. Guys, getting sleep is so important. Another reason why it is tricky not tricky. Reason it's important to get a lot of sleep is because when you're not getting a lot of sleep, essentially it changes up your hormones. Two that I'm talking about are leptin and ghrelin. So ghrelin is your hunger hormone and leptin is your hormone that regulates satiety. So basically when you've got a lot of sleep and you're feeling good, your ghrelin levels are normal, so you're not super hungry and your leptin levels like, hey, you know, I'm good as well. So you get proper satiation after eating meals. Guys, if you can hear me and if you like sleep, like I do, type sleep. I wanna hear if you can hear me because I love videos, but I don't love videos so much that I do them twice. Hello, Karen, thank you for joining. What's up, Amanda? Andrew, I think you, uh, I think I saw you on here, man. Welcome back to the show, man, I appreciate you. Um, anyway, guys, if you can hear me, type sleep. Today, I am talking about why sleep is important for fat loss. And as I mentioned, these glasses are not for, uh, not for, to make me look uh, cool. Again, these are, I bought these on Amazon for like $14. They are my blue wave blocking glasses and they enhance my quality of sleep. Um, and again, I'm gonna go back to why getting sleep is important for you know, optimal hormonal regulation. So when you don't get a lot of sleep, essentially your hunger levels are all jacked up. You're always so hunger, hungry, you never feel full. Have you ever been in a state where like you get into like four or five hours of sleep and it just seems like you can never get full or like you can always keep eating? That is a result of, and not only that, just willpower and discipline is you know, totally out the window. So getting enough sleep is so important. So this is what I do every night so in this episode, thank you, thank you, Lisa. Thank you, Tracy. Uh, thank you for commenting. I appreciate you. Ashley, thank you for joining us. Um, these are my blue wave blocking glasses that help me sleep. And this is what I do. This is my in routine that helps me stay asleep and get good quality of sleep. So thank you, Amanda. So basically, <clears throat> I go to bed every night at 9 30. Because I get up at 4 30 every day. Now, the first thing I do is two hours out 
Well, an hour and a half out, I get off my computer completely. I put on these glasses. So again, I live in a dark home. As you can see, it's super dark in here. Why I have this light. <clears throat> and so I get off the computer completely. I put on these glasses and I begin to release, releasing, releasing, listening to either two types of music. One, 90s pop that helps me feel a little happy, reduces stress, or also I listen to super relaxing meditation music. And so that helps me fall asleep. Number two is I make sure I have almonds. Almonds have magnesium. Magnesium helps to calm the central nervous system and to help you feel relaxed. And I also have carbs. Carbs help increase your body's levels of serotonin. Serotonin, serotonin converts to melatonin, and that helps you feel more restful as well. I combine that with a book, um, and I read, and then in 30 minutes, I am out by 9.30. Now, the key to getting, the, the key to getting up on time at 4.30 is one, uh, this is off topic, but I always write my reasons for why I wanna get up early at a time. Plus, I have an accountability factor, factor partner, <clears throat> his name is Bruno. Now, here's the deal with me and Bruno. Bruno's up in Michigan, and Bruno's also a nutrition coach. So, here's the deal. I have made a pact with Bruno, and I, if you ever have like trouble sticking to a goal, I recommend, one, finding someone in your life that you can be held accountable to. And for me, it's Bruno. And Bruno, for every time I get up past 4.30, I pay him money. I don't like paying people money. Like, I don't even have a lot of money. So I pay, Bruno, he's here. What up, dude? So I pay him money. Um, and same thing for him. What we do is every morning, I, I sit in my bathroom and I take a picture of myself on Instagram. Don't worry, it's not like <clears throat> for the world. It, 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 I, I put the time on it and I send it to Bruno so he knows when I, when I get up. And so he does the thing, same thing for me too. So every morning, we check, we literally check in on one another to see what time we, get up and if he doesn't get up before his time then I'm sending him a request for money and he has 24 hours to pay it or it doubles and so we hold each other accountable because we know that our goals are important to us so guys if you're looking for accountability in your life find someone in your life that you can be accountable to ask them to hold you accountable by setting up a consequence saying hey listen here's my goals and here's what I want you to do um, if I don't achieve my goals so guys if you can find someone in your life right now and this is a really great time throughout this holiday season to stick to your goals. It could be making sure you walk maybe three times out of the week, reading a book, getting up on time, sticking to your calorie goals. Guys, all these goals are so, so important. So have someone in your life. It could be your spouse. It could be your kid. Um, or like, so, so here's another example, right? So let's say that you don't have anyone you can pay money to. Another thing is just make that decision to yourself. Like every morning I don't get up before 4.30 or whatever time it is that you're gonna put money in an envelope and at the end of the month, you're gonna put that money to an organization that you do not like or a charity or something. Anyway, you like I found that when you set up painful consequences like that, then you're more likely to stick to your goal. Anyway, guys, so again, that is why I have these glasses on. Next time in the show, if you guys have any questions, let me know. I just wanna get on here. It's funny, like five minutes ago, I had no clue what I was gonna talk about um, because I uh, just had a really busy day. I'm like, then I put on these glasses. I'm like, I want to talk about these glasses because I think they're really cool and they really do help me sleep because again, they are blocking the blue waves that come from lights, from screens that helps me find a more restful environment to sleep. <clears throat> so guys, if you're not getting at least seven hours of sleep a night, please make sure you do so. It is vital for fat loss, for gaining muscle mass, for staying on track with your calorie goal. And if you guys have any questions, let me know. And next Tuesday, I'll be going over specifically what I do in the morning for my morning routine. As I mentioned, I have a very specific evening routine that I go through to make sure I'm in bed on time and then make sure I'm up on time. But I have three hours of the day that I dedicate to myself. I'm very selfish with my time, the morning time anyway. So from 4.30 to 7.30, it's my time. And I'm gonna go over exactly what I do that again, helps me stay focused on you know, my performance during the day, my nutrition goals, my training goals, etc. Guys, if you have enjoyed this episode, please comment glasses below. If you have any questions, let me know. Andrew, thank you for watching, my man. Hope you're traveling going safe. Kaylee, Mary, thank you for joining us. I appreciate you guys. Always showing support. Man, you guys are awesome. What's up, Joseph? Hey, dude, one of these days, I'd love to get you on here, Joseph.
What's up, Mark? Guys, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you guys. Have a great night. Get some rest. I will talk to you soon. God bless.